Hey everyone, in this video, let's talk about how you can add a location link to an invitation in Canva. In order to do so, here we are in Canva, and what we're looking for can be found in a few places, but if you go to the main menu here where you have a variety of options, if you select where it says more, then scroll down just a little bit, and you're going to find here where it says invitation, and this is going to be in portrait mode. So we're going to go ahead and click on this, and Canva's going to open up our invitation templates. Just give it just a moment here. So we could see now we have a variety of templates to choose from, and so you can go here and pick whatever it is that's appropriate for what you're looking for. I'm going to go ahead and select this one here, and here we have our invitation. And what we want to do is if we find here where we have the address, then we can modify this. And what I'm going to do is uh, we'll make another line here and I'm going to add Google Maps because that's how we're going to add, uh, add this link here. And then what we want to do is we want to highlight the text that we want to add the link to. And then we're going to click these three little dots here and we're going to scroll down to where you can see the option that says link. So we're going to go ahead and click on that. And then here now we have our option here to enter a link. So now we're going to go over to Google Maps and I've just got an example here that we can use. So we have our chicken box. We're going to go ahead and click share here and we're going to copy the link. And then we're going to head back over to Canva and we're going to enter in the link and we're going to go ahead and click done. So now that is going to be a clickable link and anybody who gets the invitation is going to be able to click there where it says Google Maps and that will take them to Google Maps where they can see exactly where the location is. And that's all there is to it. That's how you can add a location link in Canva. If you found this video helpful, please leave a comment and like and subscribe for more helpful tips.